Okay, so here we got the thing we are talking about. So tektite, it comes from a meteorite impact from a meteorite from outer space that hit the Earth and in an extremely high temperature with an unbelievably strong explosion, everything melt together, both the extraterrestrial extraterrestrial stuff and stuff from from the Earth. And this is so hot in this event that it's not supposed to be possible that there is gonna be any kind of liquid. So this is the first time anyone find a tektite uh, impact glass that is mixed with stuff from outer space that has a, a liquid inside. Uh, I will try to show you how it looked like. I will turn off the light and then I will use my torch. And uh, let me see first. First you can see here. Let me see. You see here, you see a lot of liquid. And this is this is already already crazy, but I when I backlight it, I have realized that the area of the liquid is actually very big and there is a lot of liquid inside. There's a huge chamber and probably more than one chamber. And when I do a swirling thing like that, you will see there is like like an oily consistency or something like that. Gas, oil, something, something is swirling around as you could see there. So this piece had been to several uh, gemological and geological labs and uh, they have absolutely no explanation. They have been checking every millimeter of the surface of this piece and uh, they don't find any man-made material covering any holes. They don't find any pores that should be let water leaking in from earth when it was in the ground. So it seems like it has been sealed at, and the liquid is from the original event uh, that uh, they think uh, happened 700,000 years ago, somewhere in Indochina. So this piece is absolutely unexplained and nobody can tell what is inside. And um, I will not destroy it to try to find out what it is, but uh, many people want to do that. Believe me, many people have contacted me and they want to buy it or they want to, uh, you know, uh, give it to a lab so they can test the liquid, what it is, because uh, there's a lot of curiosity about this. So this is basically the status. I send a link uh, from the lab, one of the lab that has been studying it, and they don't find anything fishy, nothing man-made, nothing tricky with it. Everything is absolutely natural and 700,000 years old and they have absolutely no explanation why there is some kind of liquid trapped inside of this piece. And this is all I know. So, um, for that reason, for now, I just keep it until I have a good reason to not keep it anymore. Uh, I will not crack it myself. The only thing would be that if someone uh, bought it for something that I think would be interesting for me, then I would consider that and uh, if not it will stay with me until I find a better solution or I find a way that I can find out what is inside. That's, that's pretty much what I have, what I can tell you. So um, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a very very special piece uh, that uh, the highest educated uh, scientists in the world are not explaining. Uh, to me what it is. They are not able to explain what it is. It's supposed to be impossible.